So I wanted to give you guys a quick video of what I'm doing here. So this is the start of my shipwreck cup. And what you can see is that I've done my little planks. So the dark brown that's in the background is my Brie Reese brown. So I did that. So what I did was I used these. These are removable vinyl in black. Just whatever I had in the closet. And they are half inch tall by one and a half inches long. And I cut out a ton of these. This is actually my second page of these. And then I just kind of I didn't try to line them up super close because this is a shipwreck cup. So you kind of want it to seem like the ship is breaking apart. Like that's the whole point of it. So then I did a mixture of the Ranger Butterscotch, the Brown, and the Ranger Mushroom to do the colors inside. And so you can kind of see that each one is a little, it kind of looks like wood grain, like that the waters hit it, but it's still a wood grain. And then on each of the little dots is when you, when I move it back, you can see that they have like a silvery metallic sheen to them. So each one of the little dots is hand placed with a little brush and I used the Waverly metallic multi-surface acrylic paint to do the little dots so my base coat is actually um, white and then it has a clear coat over top of it because I found that on my first go round when I did just the white base coat the beautiful little black stickers pulled the white off so I had to kind of strip it down and restart which was fun so but now what I'm doing is I'm waiting for this layer to dry and then it'll get hit with a clear coat actually a couple of clear coats it'll be really really light because you don't want it to ruin these beautiful little lines that you have in here so this is the start of my shipwreck cup